Yo! Now, I wasn't going to make a video on the lineup since everybody can see my lineup in the stream, but we got ourselves a crazy addition to the team today. I'm going to show that at the end of the video, but let's start off with the bench. We're going to go ahead and, you know, count how much each card is worth at the moment, market price, to see how much, you know, our lineup is worth. Probably one of the best lineups out there. Not the best, but one of the best. And again, I'm just going to go through, you know, why I bought the card or why I need it or why it's there. Uh, if you guys have any suggestions who I should add, replace, or remove, uh, just let me know down in the comments and let's get right into it. All right, and we all know that every team needs a cheerleader, right? Someone on the bench that never gets to play, somebody just out there cheering, going crazy. And of course, we ourselves have that as well, just because it's the perfect team. And that person is none other than Ronnie. You know, he's just, he's amazing. He's a cheerleader. Everybody needs him, you know, just, you know, it helps keep the team, you know, active and alive. And of course, he's just a great player, you know, 69 overall, amazing addition. All right, now we get to the players that actually get to play, and I know people are going to call me crazy for having this guy off the bench, but he's just too good. He can shoot from anywhere, and that is Steph Curry. Now, he's off the bench, you know, back-to-back -back MVP. I understand, 99 overall. You're probably thinking, Carlos, what are you doing? But trust me, he's too good. If I played him as my starter, I would be chucking up three-pointers every possession, which I was doing before, but, you know, off the bench, he's going to come in. You know, score some three-pointers if I need it and all that good stuff. And another player that I just got, which I haven't really played with him. I'm just going to have him in the lineup just because he's a diamond. That's going to be. And we have ourselves LaMarcus Aldridge. You know, if I need a three-pointer, a mid-range, just anything, a post fadeaway, this is the guy to go to off the bench. Great card. 96 overall. Just pulled him. Great addition to the team as well. All right, now we can get right into the bench. Now, at center, you know, this was pretty hard to decide, but I needed somebody athletic, somebody that could run the court. Everybody, you know, just rebounding, defense, just anything I needed in center. And that, of course, is Dwight Howard. Now, his picture is one of the, probably the worst pictures 2K has ever done. But it's okay. Still a great card. He has a 92 speed. He's got a post hook. He can rebound. He can block. He can shot contest. He can do everything I need at the backup center position. And then I power forward. I always need a stretch four. I need somebody that can shoot the three ball, somebody that can rebound, somebody that can just, you know, do everything I need him to do when I put him in and that of course is the Durantula now this one you know it's the Abathist I understand people are like oh you know there's a diamond I know I know but this one has a better three-pointer and that's all I need for my backup power forward is a three ball and that's all I need I don't care about the mid-range just three ball and Kevin Durant definitely does the job and of course at backup small forward we have the doctor Julius Irving in case anybody gets sick in the starting lineup we can definitely put him in get it cuz he's a he's a doctor no <laughs> Right, anyway, <laughs> that's the small forward off the bench. Great card, has a great three-pointer, mid-range, his release is money, and of course, he can dunk, and he has a 92 speed. Just amazing card overall. And at shooting guard off the bench, we have somebody that's a loose cannon, somebody that can go off, or actually get pretty cold in about like 10 seconds. We have J.R. Smith. Now, this guy has a great release. He, he pretty much does everything. He's a great overall card, defense, offense, speed, dunking everything you can wish for for this card great card now I have him off the bench because well I have somebody better at shooting guard first of all and second of all he does really well off the bench because he has this badge that makes him perform a little bit better off the bench so great addition to the team JR Swish now at point guard we have somebody that I have been playing with pretty much all year I started using his gold card probably the best gold card there is we have the diamond Kyrie Irving now this guy started for me you know until recently and I'll, I'll show you why but great card great size ups I, I've broken so many ankles with this card including LeBron James Steph Curry anyone you can name I've broken their ankles just watch my streams and uh, yeah point guard off the bench Kyrie Irving alright now we're getting to the good stuff at center position we have the one and only the best center in my opinion on my team is Anthony Davis, the unibrow, great card, speed, can shoot the three ball. I've been using Anthony Davis, the amethyst one, from the beginning of the year as well at center position. He's never disappointed me on defense. You know, on offense, you know, there's been times where, like, you know, he's been a little bit off. But on defense, dude, he can hang with any center out there, including Kareem, Shaq, anybody, bro. Great card at center, amazing, one of my favorite cards in the game. And then at power forward, we have somebody, again, that can stretch the floor, who can shoot the three ball, who can drive, who can do the mid-range. Pretty much a shooter who can stretch the floor, and that is Carmelo Anthony. Now, a lot of people are going to say, why power forward, why not small forward? You'll see in a bit, but I want to hide him on defense at power forward, because my, 
pretty much my starting lineup is pretty good defensively, except for Carmelo Anthony. But at power forward, not a lot of people run, you know, crazy players there. So it's a great spot to put him in for defensive purposes. Great card, speed, shooting, and uh, he likes on defense. But at least the card looks good, right? And then at small forward, we have somebody that's struggling in the finals right now. Uh, it's pretty much embarrassing at this point, but, you know, he at least went to the finals six straight times. And that's LeBron James. Great card. I'm waiting for the 99 overall to come out, but you know what? I'll take this one for now. 97 overall. His release is so easy. I've always loved his release on 2K. One of the easier shots to do. I know some people don't agree with that, but great card, great speed, great defender, great shooter, and of course, great driver. And at shooting guard, we have my favorite player, favorite card in the game to use, hands down. Just he, he has everything, and that's the Black Mamba. Kobe Bean Bryant. Great card, great defender, great shooter, fast. Just everything, dude. He's probably like the best rebounding shooting guard I have ever seen. He averages about like three to like six rebounds a game for the shooting guard position, which is crazy. Great card. Just amazing overall, man. I love this card. Amazing, 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 amazing. And then at starting point guard, my newest card that I came home and found out that I got for super cheap because I bid on it last night. This is just amazing. I got it for one million. The one and only Magic Johnson. Now I can't believe I got this card for one million. This card is unbelievable. He has gone for like 1.5, 2 million, 1.3, 1.2. I just bid one mil, and for some reason, nobody bid on it either. So, uh, hopefully he's not going down in price, but amazing card. I have yet to play a game with it, so if you guys want to see some gameplay with this squad or Magic Johnson, just leave the comments down below. Let me know what you want to see. And that's pretty much it, man. Point guard, shooting guard, small forward, power forward, center. Great lineup. And I just realized where I messed up on. LaMarcus Aldridge actually isn't going to be in the team. It's actually going to be John Wall. For defensive purposes so I have like three point guards off the bench that's gonna be pretty uh pretty crazy but we're gonna make that work John Wall great shooter amazing dunker and great defender but that's pretty much it man Curry John Wall Dwight Howard Kevin Durant Julius Irving J.R. Smith Kyrie and of course the starters amazing team let me know down in the comments again what I should replace who I should move etc and if you want to share your lineup as well, leave them down in the comments below. Subscribe to Join Squad XC, and as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.